Hi there everyone, I'm Newsday Meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. Hopefully everybody's having a good Sunday so far. It's nice to have the sunshine back today. High pressure is hanging on here, so we will get lots of sunshine from start to finish. And this time around, it's not going to be nearly as breezy as it was yesterday. So instead of wind chills in the teens like we had on Saturday, it'll actually feel like it's in the mid to upper 20s. Here's our hour by hour forecast, which will show you some high thin clouds moving into the area this afternoon, but it will still be quite bright out. Outside. Overnight, the clouds will thicken up, so by tomorrow morning as you get ready to head off to work and to school, just make sure that you bring an umbrella because even though it will be dry to start, it's not going to be a dry finish because notice by midday, we are going to see rain, snow, and possibly some sleet moving into the state. As temperatures are expected to warm into the upper 30s near 40 late tomorrow, we will likely see that wintry mix transition over to all rain before things dry out by Tuesday morning. So Tuesday morning, we will still have some residual cloud cover, but it will turn out to be a dry day. So tonight turning mostly cloudy and with the clouds moving in, it's not going to be nearly as cold. Temperatures will drop into the upper teens and low 20s. And then tomorrow a dry start will give way to a well, messy afternoon. Let's put it that way. So your morning commute will be fine. Your evening commute will be subpar. Now, as we look ahead to our eight day shoreline forecast, those clouds on Tuesday morning will give way to brighter conditions through the afternoon with highs in the lower 40s and overall things are looking great for the upcoming week. Well, plenty of sunshine on Wednesday and I know this is a bit subjective, but I think Thursday will be the pick of the week since we will not only have lots of sunshine, but it will finally feel milder with highs in the mid 40s. Temperatures will drop back to the 30s on Friday, but then we'll return to the 40s for next Saturday.